have something for uh, Melissa McBride. season was she's really become a, like she's really become a true leader and done stuff that I, I don't know if any of the characters would have been able to do so what do you how do you feel about Carol right now and what are your thoughts going into season five about what she's prepared to do I think the great thing about Carol is that she's just she is kind of prepared to do anything it's coming to terms with the fact that this is the world the way it is and this is what you have to do now that she's come to a place of courage to be able to do those tough things. But yeah. she's, she's a very empathetic character. But how does she keep, how does she keep grounded? Like, how do you, how does the Lizzie thing happen and then she's like, all right, let's move. Like, how does she stay I think, centered? I think it's because she, in her center, she feels justified and it comes from a place of caring. I think if, the, if it weren't for that, what's the point of living? I guess not much if you're listening. What's the point of having to do these horrible things if that's all the world is? Yeah. Uh, I also want to welcome uh, Chad Coleman uh, to the <laughs> It's such an amazing scene between Tyrese and Carol. You're like, oh, what's going to happen? What's going to happen? Oh, wow. They made peace with each other somehow because. But, so, in, in your mind, what was happening with Tyrese in that moment? Well, you know what? Hope, you say hope and heart. How does hope demonstrate itself in this world? You know, if, if, you don't, if you don't have the heart, you can't have the hope, you know? So, with, he sees, he, I, I mean, I, I don't know that, I, I think Scott would agree with this, that, you know, there is no time really that he lost sight of her humanity. If you really track, the way we went through, we, we had, you know, it was a horrific experience, almost shared experience, and a uh, complicit agreement to have to take out Lizzie, you know? So that that's a lot of, I mean, I saw her. So I didn't just see this villain. I, I, I saw someone who was uh, incredibly brave in, 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 in an incredibly harsh world. So that's why I was able to forgive her. Also, you, you look, this is, this is a little community. I mean, if, if we're gonna have hope, then we gotta believe we're gonna be able to sustain community. And we've got to, we got to build from somewhere, you know? So, destroying that community just lessens the hope that much more. So, you know, it's a twisted world, but that's what hope looks like now, you know? Doesn't look warm and fuzzy, like maybe in the real world, right? But hey, that's that's what it is. Yeah, I mean, Carol's definitely a good role model, particularly for parents who are like, kids don't act up. Or <laughs> <laughs> that's Carol. I mean, she did it. <laughs> 